So I have, these are cranberry for my bladder. These are vitamin C. Fish oils, vitamin D, because I don't have any dairy in my diet. These are uh, Sexy Strong Burn. These are biotin, and then these are prenatals. I take one of these every single day, and then I also take a probiotic and then birth control for skin and because we don't want no kids. Oops, I did that all wrong. Messing up my days on my birth control. We're gonna get you off that one a day too. You, you're taking one a day, right? Oh, these are gel capsules, huh? Okay. <laughs> these have sugar in it though, so I think I'm gonna have to stop taking these. So these have one gram of sugar, one gram of carbs. So I'm probably gonna have to remove these out of my diet as of right now. And get, there's a def million different probiotics I can choose from that's not chewable, so I'll have to go pick those up. So I religiously used to use MAC Pro Longwear Foundation and everyone always told me that was probably why I had skin problems, but I refused to believe them because it just had such good coverage. But I decided <laughs> to switch and try Dermablend. And honestly, my face has cleared so much, like in just a matter of a week. It's pretty insane. So if you're having skin problems and you use MAC Pro Longwear, you might want to look to switch. This is just as much coverage. It's a little different consistency. It's a little bit more drier. It's not as matte looking, but I like it a lot and it's helped my skin, so that's good. So when I don't have time and I'm in a super big rush, I put, mix my egg whites with my oatmeal because that's my first meal and just put it in the microwave and mix it together. So that's meal one at eight o'clock and then I have a meal at 10, which I won't be here because I'll be at church so I need to make it right now, which is just half a cup of Power, er, power Jacks, which is a pancake mix that's with uh, protein in it and then one half cup of egg whites. I just make one pancake and bring it for me to go. Big ass pancake. So I'm actually gonna vlog my whole day today. It's gonna be a busy one. We're headed first. The word of God, of course. We're gonna go ahead to C3 Church San Diego. And then right after that, I have an assessment with Maritza. Uh, I'll be three weeks out, exactly. And then from there, we're headed home. And uh, my hairstylist is driving up to put my extensions in. Uh, so next time you see my hair, it's going to be long and beautiful. And then after that... got to go get groceries, egg whites. Groceries, and then I volunteer at the church every other weekend. So this is a weekend that I'm volunteering. So I'm going to go hang out with a bunch of babies. And then after that, we train. We'll also be shooting a video today talking about it yes. works and some other products that are questionable. That's quite a busy day, you know? We just don't have time to bullshit. And we're running late to church. So hopefully God understands, you know? It's 8.23. We have to be at church at 8.30. I don't know if it's gonna happen. 8.32, not that late. Look at how nice these people are here. Everyone just waves. <laughs> You face 
faith will be put to test. God will bring certain storms in our lives, not breaking us to make us, to form and shake us. We come stronger out of the storms as we enter every storm. What it meant to be a stumbling stone, you can use it as a stepping stone in our lives, like Walt did. Just finished with the church, got the little word of God in our life. It's a good message today. It's such a powerful way to start your week. Um, now we have about an hour before my assessment, so I'm going to try and head to Costco. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to get egg whites and do a little grocery shopping. Eggs. 225 for an 18 count. Insane price. Too bad we don't need any of that. It's all about the egg whites. How many what? Three. Can't beat it. Can't beat it. I've lived here for seven years and still need to use Google Maps for everywhere I go. Everywhere I go. <laughs> Geographically challenged person in the entire world. <laughs> Single-handedly, the worst parking lot in all of Southern San Diego. <laughs> the worst. We got a blast legs today. She's a size four. She's not like multiple. No. No. Do you have heels by any chance? I do. What size are you? Oh, I'm an eight. Actually, that one for Can I wear them really quick? Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you so much. I was like, I, really I, was like, I definitely will not fit in Thank you. Oh, sorry. So unprepared. <laughs> <laughs> One sixteen point five. I woke up technically at one seventeen. No. <laughs> she doesn't poop actually. <laughs> uh, we've been together almost two years, and she doesn't poop. I'm not she has guaranteed me that she consumes all her own calories. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Danny, you're tinier already. I know. The hell? What the hell? Did you eat yesterday? Yeah, I ate all my food. I should have gave you a donut. <laughs> Cold. There you go. That was a better transition, Danny. Good and go. If it's on hold, good and go. Good. Hold and up a little bit more. There you go. Perfect. Hold it there. Good and go. Awesome, Danny. That was better. I love the back. You know how you yeah. transition from the back. You don't look like you're swinging your yeah. leg around. Oh. Cool. We shot. Competed last night. <laughs> nice. Looks good. Thank you so much for your heel. You oh, no worries. Me. I'm really hard yeah, to she has fallen <laughs> size fives. She's okay. crazy abs already. Yeah. For glutes. I'm so happy about your glutes, Danny. 
it's so much more tighter already from your last assessment. Yeah. Yeah, no. Me uh, too. Hands. Me too. Oh, you too. Oh, how's your legs, by the way? Okay. <laughs> so you have no butt control. We figured that out. <laughs> Uh, it's just different. Like yeah. she, she trained with Danny. Thank you, okay, I'll see you later. She doesn't rest. <laughs> I'll see you later. Of course, none of my girls rest when they train. What's rest? <laughs> we don't do rest. You recovery. I know, no recovery. That's how we train. So it's a little hard. Yeah. So last week, basically, to be the supportive boyfriend, I ran through Danielle's glute and hamstring workout. Well, it's pretty much races. Yeah. Well. <laughs> And I almost threw up. Like absolutely yep. horrible. Um, That's different. The, the That's why I don't train man. <laughs> they have no stamina, no endurance, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm not kidding. They bench press. They just bench press. <laughs> yeah, it's like body's changing. I'm happy with the way like this has been able to go now because yes. I feel like we're we're not like playing catch up or. No, your weight is perfect. Your body looks good. You're not playing. You don't really play catch up. It's like sometimes I have to feed you more. Yeah. So it seems like we found a good formula with your meals. Yeah. Or your weight is not dropping so fast, but you're getting leaner and leaner slowly. Right. They change already. It's mm -hmm. impressive. Yeah, I feel like I'm getting okay. feel good. Good. How hungry are you? Are you hungry at I'm all? I'm getting really hungry. Oh, good girl. All your meals are clean. We're just adding a little burger at 12 p.m. and the sushi stays at 4 p.m. Okay. Okay? Just gonna keep you a little satisfied and not happy. And that one burn before meal one still works for you. Yeah, and then I'm still doing one two more PM. and two. Yeah. Good. I just finished up my assessment with Maritza. So the only thing that really changed my week meals are staying the exact same. As uh, my body's responding really well to that. So I shouldn't change anything there. And then I get a burger today at 12. Um, from in and out obviously no cheese, and then that's pretty much it. My cardio, uh, my last plan, my cardio was supposed to be at 150, but I've been kind of pushing it to 200, 225, so she's happy with that, that's okay. So now my new goal is 250 calories uh, to burn five days a week. So cardio went up a little bit, but that's just mainly because of my preference. That's really it, not much to change at all. Really happy with the results. My coach is super proud, so Excited to see what I'm gonna look like next assessment. <laughs> okay, um, can I just get a number one with no cheese, please? Alrighty, would you like onions on your double meat? Yes, light. Alrighty, and your drink? Um, actually, sorry, no drink. I'll just do the fry and the burger. Okay, so I have a double meat with onion and a fry. Correct. Will you be eating in the car? Uh, no to go, please. Do you want anything? Uh, Five eighteen at the first minute. Okay. Uh, sorry, there's more. Oh, okay. Um, and then can I just get another number one grilled onions, mustard fried, with a diet coke? You got it. Thank you. Is that everyone? Yes. Sorry. Oh, cool. So I have a double double with grilled onion mustard fried, a double meat with onion, two fries, and a medium diet coke to go. Correct. Be twelve sixty nine at the first window, please. Thank you. Thank you. She knows me so well. So well, I'm very. Like I feel good inside right now. You know. I listen. I pay attention to you. We've been together almost two years. She just figured out my birthday last month. <laughs> True story. I always knew it. I just couldn't remember it. It wasn't that important of a date. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really happy with that assessment. Chilly, I think you look phenomenal. Yeah, I've, just, I've been working really hard. Like last prep, I mean, I worked really hard, but I feel like just with how fast everything was that I kind of just showed up and one, like this prep, I really truly want to feel like I earned it. We worked hard for no. it. You can't act like that. I mean, genetics aside, you, I've been in this game a long time. I mean, not even just for a man, but like, you were in the gym day in, day out, six days a week, and you work out harder than anybody I've ever met. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, legitimately, I just don't think that people understand that that's the level of like commitment you have to training. Like, I mean, in the off season, is your diet always perfect? No, absolutely not, no one does. But I still think, 
us as a couple or you as an individual, however you want to look at it, that we eat far cleaner than yeah. a large vast of not the population of the industry. You know? mm-hmm. There's a reason that we're lean year round. Yeah. Same with like the cardio too. Like I'm really glad I'm actually doing cardio this time around, and like I just feel like I'm understanding the whole process this time, and not just like here's workout, strap on a tan and put on a bikini and go in. Right. Like I really want to truly feel like I earned every bit of this. Like even yesterday, like the difference between holding on while doing cardio versus not. Like yesterday, I really pushed myself to just like having my hands up and like doing like just straight legs. Like I'm just really pushing myself so. I want to feel like I've completely earned it. Yeah. And I feel like that's the difference, like, in why my body's just looking the way it does right now compared to... Yeah, I mean, you're, I mean I'm not definitely saying that you're 100% invested, and I think that this prep is going very, very well. I just don't want you to discredit your previous wins. Yeah. I mean, you, no matter what you tell yourself, you're never going to show up to a muscle contest and walk away with an overall just because you showed up. Yeah. You know? A little champion. <laughs> Thanks. Kiss me. That was dangerous. I live on the wild side. If we die for love, it's okay. That's not okay. I don't want to die. <laughs> Especially for love. I hear my ride or die. I, well, why do we gotta die? <laughs> <laughs> we get food first. <laughs>